Oh, jump. Yes! Oh my gosh, it's a big fish, dude. That's a monster. What's up, y'all? I'm at a spot that I haven't fished in actually a really long time, I think. And we're seeing some, some pretty big, big fish come up. So we're gonna go ahead and get three lines out and we're also gonna throw either a gulp worm or a spoon or something, just see what we can get. But the water's high right now, so I think a lot of fish are getting pushed into here, which is good. So let's see if we can get on a monster. Oh, dude! Maybe there are big ones here. Or maybe just because the water's high, they're coming in. Dude, there's monsters out here. You know, I will walk over there to cast one. All right, guys, we got a fish on both rods right now. There are fish everywhere. This is kind of crazy. I'd wait a while. He just picked it up. Wait like a minute. Unless he's just like taking all the line. And I'd walk over here too. I don't think he's that small. He's got some big head shakes going. Turn the drag down a little. Oh, he might be good size. Oh yeah. Look at that clear water gar. We're gonna get it. Would you mind getting that black rope out the top of my bag? He's pulling me in the water, dude. And if y'all are wondering why I'm not getting my buddy to help me rope it, it's cause I get nervous about the fish thrashing and I like to be in control of it. <laughs> Almost. Yeah, you can hold it. <laughs> All right, pull him a little to the left. Okay. Let's tag him. Oh man. All right, guys, we're gonna go ahead and tag this fish. Alrighty, guys, first fish of the day. By no means is it a giant, but it's good to finally get one. We've lost a couple, and we've seen some serious monsters come up. This is a baby compared to those. So we're gonna go ahead and get some more baits out and hopefully we can get this guy's big brother. Let's go ahead and let him go. Guys, it is raining a little bit, but I think we found the secret and that is to keep our baits off the bottom. I just casted this one out and instantly we got a bite. He's swimming to the right. So I think I'm gonna hold off, put my other lines out till the rain chills out, but we're gonna see if we can get this fish. Guys, I'm walking around here to cast out to the deep water because there is a huge guard that keeps coming up, like huge. And the gar in here are always really pretty colored. They always look really cool. So it'd be really nice to catch a really big one that's like dark. Dude, I want to jump in so bad. Guys, something just picked up that big mullet. Now a four to five footer could bite that, but considering the fish I've seen out there, I'm thinking it's gonna be a nice one. So let's let's stay hopeful. Uh, next, okay, yeah, go. Back up, jump. Yes, sir! That's the hook set I'm looking for! <laughs> let's, let's 
go. No way. You're gonna have to get up at some point though. <laughs> How's that, bro? Oh, that, was <laughs> that was perfect. I'm eager to see how big this one is because that was a big mullet. You can uh, loosen the drag a little bit now. Here, try to get him away from this line. Oh. Yes, sir. I see that mullet in there, too. He's gonna, uh, yeah, I was just about to say, he's gonna freak out a couple times. Here, try to get him away from this line. Keep the, uh, line just a little bit, because I don't want it to like cut my neck off. This is the size that caused me to hook my finger. But they're big enough. I mean, they're small enough to where you can leader them like a, a sailfish. Dude, that is the most perfect hook set I've ever seen in my life, Jake. It's right in the corner. That was money. And that was awesome, too. Dude, yeah, because that was a hell of a hook set. Dude, let go. They always bite onto the grass. Now, what we do want is the fish to be on its belly, so if it thrashes, it's not going to thrash up. Damn. <laughs> All right, so what you're gonna do is you're gonna pull this down and then you're gonna hold it tight. And you don't want his face, you wanna hold your face away from your face like that. Yeah. Oh my gosh, see that's the fish I'm looking for. Just came up out there. Don't put your hand behind there cause it'll stab you, put it right here. So we're gonna go ahead, get this dude back. <clears throat> Hopefully we see him another day. I would tag him, but I don't know where my tool is to tag the fish. We're gonna have to find that. Always want to be behind them. They can't hurt you from behind. So it is officially pouring. It keeps going in random spurts, and we figured, what's the point of going back to the truck if we're just gonna go, come back, and it's gonna rain, and just keep doing it over and over again. So we're Pushing through, no lightning, just a lot of rain. Here we go. All right, so there was lightning, and so we, we got out of there. We're waiting in the truck right now at the lakefront, and we're gonna fish the mouth of the canal and the lake. We're gonna throw out some live mullet, some cut mullet. I'm obviously fine catching gar all day, but I think we have a good chance of getting into jacks, reds, sharks, whatever. I don't have any wire leader rigged up right now, so if we get broken off, then I'll tie some on, but right now we just need the rain to stop. All right guys, someone just picked up this mullet. It's pretty quick. Yep, we got one. I got something, I don't know. We're fishing the lake, so it could be anything. All right guys, he hasn't had it for too, too long, but I'm kind of running out of line here. I don't know if I should set it or what. I think I'm gonna go ahead and do that. Here we go. Oh my gosh, that's a big fish. That's a big fish. That's a big fish, dude, that's a monster. Dude, that's a monster. That's a six footer, no, no because I don't want him to feel tension. That's a six footer. Oh my gosh. If he's not six foot, he's freaking close. I don't know if I was recording for half of that, but I don't care. We got him. Oh man. Okay. 
God. All right, guys, we got finally a big one today. I say big, but he's, he's pretty large. He's not the fish we're looking for, but we got it tagged, and we're gonna go ahead and get this hook out. See him another day. I'm shaking so hard. Let's get this dude back in the water. Alrighty guys, long day, really tough day with all the rain and stuff, but it was super fun and I've kind of been in a slump catching big gar. I've lost a few recently that I'm not too happy about, but I made up for it today and caught that huge one. And it was only five foot seven, but I swear the head on that fish was that of a six and a half footer. That was a very disproportionate fish. I have had to guess it's probably 90 to 100 pounds, um, somewhere around there, but awesome fish. It was really cool looking, it was dark and we had a great time. So hopefully we can get back out there soon, try some new spots, jump around a little bit, and see if we can catch some big fish. I know there's a lot of sharks and stuff in the lake right now. Those are always fun. Hopefully see y'all soon, and I'll see y'all in the next fishing video.